hello everyone in my previous video i showed you how to send private chat messages now in this video i will show you how to send images in the private chat message in sketchware so to understand this video you must watch the previous video otherwise it will be difficult to understand so here this is the chat page private chat page and it contains this image view which is image view 2 this is for picking the image then there is text view 2 this is for displaying the file name the name of the image file then there is progress or one which will be visible when the image is being uploaded then there is edit text one which is for displaying the message for writing the message and there is this image view send which is for sending the message okay now in on create method i make text view 2 set visible gone and progress bar 1 set visible gone then i have these components firebase auth component f auth the firebase storage component f store file picker fp for picking images then i have this firebase db component chat1 for private chat and chat2 for private chat and there is this firebase db component chat list for chat list and firebase db chat list 2 for chat list and intent component intent now in on create i have set a string variable user id user underscore uid to activity get extra key uid this is uid of second user and uh, i have set my uid to firebase auth get uid and then i have stopped listening for all the firebase db components for chat one i have set the reference to user one and chat two i have made reference to user two the user one is private chat slash my uid slash user underscore uid and user two is private chat slash user underscore uid slash my uid so how to send the message first user will click on image view 2 to pick the image file file picker fp pick files and in on files picked event i set the string variable file to get at zero of listing file path then i set string file name to get last segment path of file and i make text view to set visible visible text view to set text file name and when the send button is clicked if the string file is empty then i send this text message and here i add these keys message id uid text time and image url and here you can see that the image underscore url value is empty and this is sent to chat1 chat2 then this chat list with reference to my uid and chat list with reference to user underscore uid the same map variable is sent to these four locations but if file value of file is not empty then i upload the image so here i use firebase storage app store upload file path file with name as file name and here i make image view send set enable false text view to set text uploading progress bar one set visible visible so while the image is being uploaded the send button will not be not work and progress bar one will be visible then in on upload success event here once the file is uploaded i send the message for that i get the current time from calendar and then i set a string variable message id to chat one push get key then i create a new map variable put key message underscore id value message underscore id put key uid value firebase auth get uid this is uid of sender put key text value edit text one get text and put key time value the calendar get time in milliseconds converted to string without decimal and then i put key image underscore url value this download url and then i send it to chat1 using the key message id and chat2 using key message id and then i define chat list by making reference to chat underscore list slash my uid and add key user uid value map 
then i define chat list by making reference to chat underscore list slash user underscore uid and then i add key my uid value math then i toast message sent and set edit text value to empty after this i set file name to empty file to empty and then send button set enable true text view to set visible gone and progress var one set visible gone so all this is there in on upload success in if there is any failure in uploading then i toast the message and i make progress bar one set visible gone and send button set enable true that's all for uploading once the file is uploaded we can get it in on create using this value event listener applied to this chat one here to this chat one i've added this value event listener and in this value event listener i get the data to this map list and then I refresh this list view one. And here at the top, I have already set custom view date of this list view one to map list. So here in on bind custom view for displaying the image, if this map list contains a position key image URL, and if this key image URL value equals empty, then I make image view one set visible gone else if it is not empty then i make image view one set visible visible and image view one set image from url get value at position key image underscore url of list map map list and if it doesn't contain key image underscore url then i set image view one set visible gone and when image view one is clicked i use intent to move to view activity with extra key url whose value is get value at position key image underscore url of list map map list now let's have a look at the view activity this is very simple the view activity is an empty activity it is a full screen activity with no toolbar and status bar no status bar no toolbar there is a web view in on create i add the settings for this web view one web view one dot get setting dot set built in zoom controls too and i also set display zoom controls false set load with overview mode true and set use wide viewport true after this for web view one i set cache mode to load cache else network and then i load url activity get extra key url and that's all now let's have let's check the project so this is the project and here for sending a message suppose i select an image like this one and i don't write any message and click on this send button it will upload the image it will start uploading and once the image is uploaded it will display message sent and it will display the image here and when i click on this image it will open it in view activity in this full screen mode and I, here I can zoom this image. So that's on this video. Thank you very much for watching this.